Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Clever Coin here. I hope we're all doing well. Today we're going to be doing a dual unboxing. I think this is the first for my channel. But before we do that, if you guys want to do me a huge favor, please hit that like and subscribe button. Again, I do have a giveaway for my 500 subscriber mark. Um, we're creeping up there slowly but surely, and I really do appreciate you guys for all the support. But anyways, I had no idea what both of these packages were, so it was super fun to open them up, um, especially this one. Uh, I think I know what it was, but I'm not sure. So we'll save this one for the end. Well, I do know now, but <laughs> when I opened the packages, I wasn't sure. Yeah, so I was excited for both of these. Uh, if you guys don't know who he is, Lemonhead Penny, an uh, awesome guy. He's a part of our stacking community, and he does auctions, he does coins, and he has a, a bunch of cool stuff. I'll make sure to leave his channel linked down below. Um, and I really do appreciate it, Lemonhead Penny, for all these extra stuff, you know, those few stickers, and then that extra V-nickel. Um, super, super cool. Well, I, I kind of spoiled it. <laughs> yeah, this one, I had no idea what it was uh, until I did a little bit more research on it, and Southside Stacker did a video on it as well. So it was perfect timing, 1911 V-nickel. Super cool. I don't know anything this old, and it's just a whole other aspect about our community, you know, our older coins and, you know, finding cool pennies or, you know, rare uh, change from, you know, older times. So I really do appreciate it for you, you know, helping me out with that. And this is what I uh, ended up purchasing from the auction. Um, I wanted to pick these up a while ago, and these are silver certificates. I'm sure most of you guys know what these are. Um, both of, all of these are 1957 um, yeah, I think they're all 1957. I have two star notes. Um, to be frank, I have no idea what that means, but bear with me guys. I'm still learning. Uh, but these are actually in pretty cool shape. I did want to pick these up, like I said, a while ago, and I was just going to go to eBay and find some, but I just decided to pick them up from Lemonhead Penny. You know, uh, might as well give back to the community. We're helping each other out to grow and like, you know, just grow our passion together. So thank you so much, Lemonhead Penny. Super awesome. Like I said, I wanted to purchase these before. So yeah, it's like I said here, it is a star note. Uh, yeah, if you guys know what that is, please explain it to me. I'll really appreciate it. Lemonhead tried to explain it to me, but I really don't remember. Something about the serial number of the original dollar getting messed up, so they do it again, but with a star, I'm not sure. I'm sure you guys will let me know in the comments down below. And now time for this. Um, once I picked it up, I knew exactly what it was, and I was super excited. Can you guys guess? Just guess, guess, guess. Yep, I finally did it. I'm starting to invest more in gold. This is a 1 4th ounce 2017 American Eagle. Super beautiful. Uh, most people say this is the best size for gold, and I, I think I'm going to agree. Um, not 100% sure yet because I haven't bought you know half an ounce or an ounce yet, but sure enough, I am definitely going to start focusing a little bit more on my gold um, just because my stack of silver is nearing the 300 mark and I don't even have an ounce of gold quite yet. So I'm definitely going to focus more on purchasing this gold. I know the silver to gold ratio, yeah, 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 but I think it's best to be diversified because we never know what's going to go down. So might as well stay diversified. Alright guys, if you guys have any suggestions, please leave them in the comment section down below. See you guys next time. Peace.